Sicilian Defense, Open, Classical, Richter Rosser Variation, 6, E67.QD2H68.BXF6GXF69.000A610.F4. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. Rating Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The C pawn in the Sicilian defense controls the D4 square. Nf3 moves the knight toward the center in anticipation of a pawn push on d4, where it will be ready to retake the piece if black captures on d4. Nc6 aids in maintaining control over the d4 and e5 squares. d4 offers to trade a center pawn for the c5 pawn in exchange for more control of the center and quick development. Cxd4 provides black two key pawns while giving white only one. NXD4 recaptures the pawn and activates the knight in return for having one central pawn versus black's two central pawns. NF6 develops the knight toward the center and attacks the undefended E4 pawn. NC3 defends the E4 pawn and puts more pressure on the D5 square. D6 prevents an E5 pawn push and allows the light squared bishop to develop. BG5 immediately attacks the knight on F6 and prepares the possibility of queenside castling. E6 defends the d5 square and allows the dark squared bishop to develop to e7. Qd2 supports the bishop on g5 and prepares to castle queenside. A pawn kicks the opposing bishop, forcing it to move or risk being captured. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Recaptures. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling queenside tends to be more active because the rook is closer to the center. Games Master It is the final book action. The game was almost evenly matched, but black is now worse. It is incorrect. Although white had had the upper hand, the game is now almost even. It is incorrect. A powerful play. It is quite good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. By doing this, a queen moves off of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is best. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is ideal. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. That's good. That's a decent move. That's good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. This let the adversary could threaten a queen and win a tempo. It is incorrect. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. Very precise. It is best. On the file, the rooks are strategically doubled and forcefully combined. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This is a poor attempt at defending a pawn that was being attacked. It is incorrect. This captures a knight and eliminates a threat. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Backs off. It is ideal. That was a great move and very hard to find. This is the only move that works. It is brilliant. This takes down a knight who is helpless. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. This poses a queen winning danger. It is ideal. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. This allows the knight to control more squares. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This evades the check from the knight. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. This threatens to win material. It is excellent. 
the queen is therefore moved to safety. It is ideal. This can indicate that a queen was attacked. It is quite good. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. Backs off. This poses a queen winning danger. It is ideal. This enables the adversary to capture a pawn and gain territory. It is incorrect. This misses an opportunity to capture a vulnerable pawn. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is a miss. There was just one smart move to be made. This misses a chance to threaten a rook and gain tempo. It falls flat. This loses material. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a rook. It is a blunder. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores an opportunity to win material. It is a miss. This ignores a better way to move a rook to safety. This allows the opponent to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is a miss. This is a missed chance to expose a pawn onslaught. It falls flat. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. This poses a queen winning danger. It is ideal. This wastes a chance to protect a pawn that was being attacked. It is incorrect. This attacks a queen, winning a tempo when it moves away. This is the only move that works. This was a game-changing move, giving white a winning position. It is a great move. This creates a counter threat against an opposite queen, as opposed to retreating from an attack. It is best. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. This defends the pawn that was attacked. That's good. That was a truly amazing move. It is brilliant. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is quite good. That pawn's capture grants you material. It is quite good. This reveals an assault that poses a threat to a bishop. That's good. Thus, a bishop is won. It is ideal. This defends the bishop who was attacked. It is quite good. This wins a queen. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. Rating.